Hey, what's going on guys? I've got a 2006 Jeep Grand Cherokee and I'm gonna show you where you can find the five fuses and the one relay for the operation of your power outlets. This information is good for any Jeep Grand Cherokee made from 2005 to 2010. So we're gonna start by checking the three fuses that are inside of the car. And you'll need some needle nose pliers like this to really get at it. We're gonna pop down here. Now this car has the two outlets in the front and there's one outlet in the back. To open the fuse box here, you push on this little tab to the side and that will allow the door to pop down. Now the three fuses in here for us to check are gonna be those three 20 amp fuses. The top fuse is for the rear power outlet while the middle fuse is for the power outlet on the passenger side. And the very bottom fuse there, that is gonna be for the power outlet on uh, for the cigarette lighter. So to check the fuse, you basically just grab it with the needle nose and pull it straight out. So just like that, that's how you remove a fuse. And you can look through a fuse and see if it's blown. As you can see, this is an example of a good fuse. So check those fuses out. Now, the bottom fuse, being the uh, the fuse for the cigarette lighter, that fuse actually has a relay that turns it on and off. So that that uh, outlet is only on when the car is on. The other two are on constantly. And that relay is actually on the back of the fuse box here. So this very top relay, that is the relay for the cigarette lighter. Uh, the cigarette lighter relay sends the power to the fuse in here. The other two fuses in here get sent power as well from these fuses out here. So these are larger fuses. You get at you get at them by squeezing the tabs here on either side. This 30 amp J case fuse provides power to the rear power outlet fuse as well as the passenger side power outlet. And this 30 amp fuse provides power to the cigarette lighter relay, which when turned on turns gives power to the cigarette lighter on the driver's side. So yeah, thanks for watching and uh, please let me know if you have any more questions or if you have any advice about troubleshooting the power outlets on your Jeep Grand Cherokee.